Good evening, <clears throat> President Stegman, members of the board, Dr. Pettacone, and council. My name is Maribel Roybal. I am the president-elect for the Tucson Education Association. TEA represents the overworked teachers, hard-working teacher assistants, the do-everything office managers and attendance clerks, the few librarians and counselors left in our schools, and many others in this district. Many of these classified and certified employees work beyond their normal work hours to ensure that students, parents, and community receive the best education. And I ask that you please do not kick your employees while they're already down. Help them up and dust them off by supporting them. Remember, your employees at this site are the first to see the students and the parents every day. I've got to say, things are not flowing well in TUSD. Thank you. Pedicone, Lead Council Durkin. My name is Lucy Messing and I am the current president of the Tucson Education Association. Counting my days, I think there's 13 left. <laughs> I spoke with Dr. Pedicone and went on record that they were asking, what they were asking was problematic. We cannot ask employees to do more and offer no compensation. When employees have not received a raise in three years and ASRS is going up, it blatantly sends the wrong message. Again, you are asking those who can least afford it, those who work directly with the children, to sacrifice more. It's unacceptable. And things are not flowing well in TUSD. At first I had hopes with the new superintendent that we would be taking a fresh approach in negotiations. That is not the case. So now let me tell you why things are not flowing well in TUSD. This by far is the worst year I have seen in negotiations. My name is Frances Benalis and I'm the Vice President, <laughs> Vice President of Lampert TA and a 17 year elementary teacher. Governing Board, Dr. Pettacombe, things aren't flowing well in TUSD right now. Many employees were hopeful when Dr. Pettacombe was hired as superintendent to TUSD and many were committed to supporting Dr. Pettacone and this board to make the necessary changes for TUSD to thrive. However, in the very short time that De Dr. Pettacone has been superintendent, his leadership, decisions made about turnaround schools, ethnic studies, professional development, and now negotiations have been quite the opposite. Employees, I heard the words from Dr. Pettacone for collaboration and working together to build trust, but actions speak louder than words. Dr. Pettacone has been in this district for less than five months and he may not be going anywhere, but neither will TUSD if we continue on this plan. But we need so to now change. let me tell you why things are not flowing well in TUSD. Things aren't flowing well in TUSD right now. And things are not flowing well in TUSD. I've got to say, things are not flowing well in TUSD. Thank you. Thank you. 